Okay, here goes. So, first, what we're going to do is um, put. The, uh, we're going to get find an image of a Marston 4G sash lock. So I've, I've typed. I put Marston 4G in Google, searched. Okay, and this is what I've come up with. Okay. Um, I've already been. I've already know exactly where I'm going. I've looked in different places for images, but the images here aren't too good because they've they've already got watermarks. So I'm going to this one browse UKPLC because they have an image here which is not watermarked. If I scroll down looking for Marston 4G, there it is Marston 4G sash lock. And then I'm going to click on the image, and there's the image. Okay, so I right click and I copy. Okay, then I go into Photoshop. Okay, this is one that I've already done. So, <sighs> what I do, okay, is I go up there and I go into file new I want a new image and it's going to come out automatically with the right size of the image and then I edit and I paste and that's the image we've taken okay but the image has to be the, the image has to be this size not this size because this is the right size image for what we need to do to put into table um, table seven on the page layout. So the image size on this is image size is two three two width and two seven five height. Okay, so we create a new image, file new, and its width is two three two, and the height is 275 okay and there you have it okay. so now what we do is we take this image okay and we put it in here okay and we edit yes wait please we got okay so that's the image there okay and what we do is we'll we can adjust it so we go to edit transform okay hold on one second let me move this down a bit edit transform rotate and that means you can now rotate this image so I'll rotate it so it's a bit straight yeah double click and then I can just move it down perfect okay right now with this image so this image we can get rid of we don't need it anymore or we'll keep it just in case no uh, and then what we what we need to do with this is get it to match the same color as this. So the way we do that is we go up to the image properties mode. We go to grayscale, okay, and it asks you if you want to flatten the image. Yes, okay. Then you go back into so now it's it is now grayscale image it means it's got no color. Color's been taken out of it but now we need to put color back into it so we go back up there to the image mode yes mode and we go to RGB color okay so now this we can put color into this image okay so we'll put this here so it doesn't get confusing and we go to image adjustments and then we go to color balance okay and the color balance oh, cancel that so we still need this image here image adjustments color
color balance. The color balance we want to try and get as the same as this. Okay, so the way we normally do that is we adjust the blue and the cyan. Okay, to its maximum, and so you can see the you can see the colors changing slightly. We okay that. Now we need to do a bit more. Image adjustments color balance again. Let's try it again. So we go to blue cyan just slightly, but I think we need to make just very slightly cyan. Okay, and I think one more go. Image adjustments color balance, and we'll just go cyan cyan as much as we can, and I think that's okay. That is fairly good. So now. Uh, what we need to do is get the writing, okay? So it is. I can't remember the name of the lock. The name of the lock is. Marston 4G 6 lever sash lock. Okay, so. We'll just grab all that information. Now, what we need it here. So we hit the text, put that there, and then edit, paste. So now we have that information. Okay, um, so I'll put that there. Okay, Marston 4G6 Libra Sash Lock. I think let's try and get that the same, the text, the same color as the picture. Okay. So what we do is we go there, go there. This is the color picker, and the color picker we will grab from there. Okay, okay, and so. And let's go to the background and okay, that's fine. That will do. Okay, and then we save this file. Save as So what we actually need to do is save this as the we so we need to use this name to save it because that image needs to have that name on there. Okay, so we will put here Marston four G. Save. 